Hey, 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 guys. Welcome to another episode of Brew and Build. I guess we're cooking up some brick here. How'd you guys enjoy that time lapse? Uh, it was actually extremely easy for me to make. Um, last time it took like, I don't know, six hours to work on. And this time it took me like 30 minutes. A replay mod kind of baffles me a little bit. I'm not really sure why it was so easy to work with, but we got a nice little deep area here. Uh, it's actually, it's pretty deep. Oop, this is going to hurt. Yep. It's pretty deep. Um, originally, it was all right at this level. So I decided to just deepen it at, down to he about, uh, it's like, what, five blocks deeper? Something like that. Yeah, five blocks deeper. I think it's good. I think this is a good level. It doesn't need to be super deep. Um, and I think it makes sense. It's kind of like bowl shaped almost. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that time lapse. It was actually, it, I mean, like I said, it was not hard to work with. It was super simple. Um, and so, yeah, I, it, it's that's really encouraging because before it was awful and I was not looking forward to making time lapses. Of course, I start recording when the sun goes down. Um, but yeah, so last episode we made this uh, dock here, and today we're gonna decorate it. And so I got all this stuff with me, and what I think we're gonna do is we're gonna be doing a decent amount of talking today, just to talk and uh, go on, talk about the future of this area this little area over here that we're going to be working on some of these uh, shops and stuff um and so yeah we'll just be laying out some simple dock stuff um and chatting about sort of some ideas i've had some ideas from you and uh some uh kind of get some thoughts going here um and so what i'd like to do is make i think over there kind of like a um market of some sort don't really know it's like kind of yeah kind of like a market with stalls and stuff uh and i think it'll be really cool um and i just want i think i want this area to be just real crazy um i changed the i got rid of the door here um and i think i just want this to be crates doesn't need to be anything super special um and maybe that one can be a double. Yeah, that's fine. Um, so I wanted to first give a little shout out and thanks to, let me see if I, I don't know if I'm going to say this right, Not So Nutso Gaming, I think. It seems pretty simple to say. I hope I said it right. Uh, not So not so Nutso. I don't know. Um, he gave, he or she, I suppose, um, gave plenty of ideas and also brought up a, a fair point because the original idea I had for this area was to make one of these a blacksmith and he brought up the fair point of if this is a smaller town which I would say this is it's moderate it's moderately small we certainly are not as big as I'd like to make it like we still have all over there to make and so it's, it'll be a decent sized town but currently it's small um, and the point that they made was that uh, it wouldn't maybe make that much sense to have a blacksmith because they may not use metal tools and stuff um, and really the only reason why I was wanting to make a blacksmith and was like felt a little hard set on the blacksmith was because I wanted to make a super smelter. Um, but the more I thought about it, I guess we don't need this here anymore since we got that guy. The more I thought about it, I kind of came to the conclusion that we don't necessarily need a full-on blacksmith. Uh, maybe that could be something they import. Since we've got this area, we might as well build on, build upon the lore um, a good amount. And they made some great suggestions as well um, of different shops and such, and gave me got me going on the uh, thinking and such of what we're going to be 
really trying to build up the lore here with. Uh, and so I think the main exports from this area are going to be fish, fishing supplies, that sort of stuff, since this is a nice bay area. They've got a lot of water. Um, I think fish and fishing supplies would be really good. Um, and also, um, like, either wheat or bread. Um, because he, he, some of the ideas, I'll just tell you some of the ideas he had. Or, I, I don't know if it's he, they had. Uh, so they were thinking bakery, customs house, uh, tannery. If you don't know what the customs house is, basically it's that. It's not so much of a physical house nowadays in our world, um, but it's a house to deal with all the work, paperwork and um, detailed work of the imports and exports from uh, a town or city or government. Any, really, there's a lot of different custom houses, uh, customs houses. Um, a tannery, I think, would be really cool, having a little tannery. And these are all things that um, stalls could also be could be selling. Um, I think having a fish market would be actually something that would be really, really cool uh, because of the new fish that are coming out, that we could get a good amount. What else do we want to add? Maybe some barrels. Um, I think that could be really cool. It could be pretty neat to have some, or do we want these barrels? Man, I don't even know. Maybe right here would be good. It, um, ooh, that's gonna change. Um, do I have, I got Acacia, that'll do. Um, and so, one of the ideas that I would love to do, that was a weird way of saying love. <laughs> that I would really like to do. I have no idea if this is going to actually look that great, but... Oops. Guess I got rid of that path block. Would be... Eh, but that doesn't look that bad. It's not bad. Um, not great, actually. Why don't we just do... That. That's okay. That's not bad. A little bit of wheat. Um... And I think what I would really love to do is like a fish market, like a, a, a good sized market, but specifically geared towards all the different types of fish. Um, because there's going to be so many fish in the, in the update, I feel like that could be something that's really, really cool and be really neat, honestly, um, that you can't really do right now because there's only, what, two fish? A three if you count puffer fish, I guess. Um, let's see, what else do we want to put here? No, I'm probably gonna want that. Uh, let's slap some. I haven't gotten around to changing these crates up. Put a crate there. Um, make it look like a crate is stacked up there. Sure. Um, I haven't gotten. Ooh, I always forget that that's a note block now. Haven't gotten a chance to change the crate texture. I think I'm going to change it to being looking more like this, more like matching with these, the trap door and door, oak door. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to change it to match better like this and be different because we want to be different. We don't want to just copy. Uh, that's something that I think we all have agreed on and think would be good um and so uh that also brings me to another idea yeah i don't know what that do right there um an idea i had so you know what are they called are they called jukeboxes we can't even we're not gonna be able to craft it jukeboxes or the record players, whatever they're called. Um, I think those could be super cool. <laughs> those could be super, super cool to have. There, stop making noise, you. They could be really, really cool to have um, in 
Oh, what am I trying to say? Um, sorry, it's late, and I, because of Easter break, I haven't really been, had the chance to really backlog too much. Uh, I just kind of have jumped into this, uh, given it is more of a whirl than a actual planned out. And I'm sorry if the quality seems a little rushed and all that. It's just me. I just really want to get out, get a video out to you guys for one. Um, but I also really want to try out this kind of new schedule uh, with the trying to do, what is it? Where are we going with? A video Monday, Tuesday, and then Thursday, Friday. So doing four, but shorter. So this one's going to be shorter. It's just going to be detailing the doc out. Uh, that time lapse also will help. Time lapses really helps save time. Like you don't have to deal with a bunch of different stuff. Yeah, that looks good. I don't think it needs. Maybe we'll do some stuff there. Put it. That's not following physics. Um, put that there. Um, and so I really want to try that. Out right now and I to, in order to do that I can go there I can go there sure these don't really matter that much they're just to add a little bit of something um, but yeah I really want to get a video out to you and uh, get just get onto that schedule to really try it out and this weekend probably was the worst weekend <laughs> to oh yeah that looks so much better with just some stuff uh, and we're going to have some little shootouts, I think. I think that'd be good. Maybe here in the middle area. Kind of planning out to have a few. And then... I haven't really thought of the dock itself. We can tr maybe do a little bit of that on camera. Um, but I really wanted to try out that schedule. And in order to do that, I kind of... Tonight, I have to get a video recorded. Not necessarily edited. But I have to get a video recorded. Uh, and so this is a good kind of mini project to work on, aren't you, son? But it's got to get done nonetheless, and I think it's real good. I mean, honestly, that's pretty good. We could put some flowers in a few occasionally. I was going to throw some wheat around, especially if this is like, that's one of their kind of main exports. Also could make a really good ground, bro ground, bleh, ground block. Um... I think that could be kind of neat, actually, as a ground block. Let's see. Just adds a little bit of texture. Just a little bit of difference in the ground. If they're going to be exporting wheat, there's going to be wheat around. Hmm. Not a big fan of that. That I think that's the only ground texture we should have if we're going to have wheat down. Um... Not a ton. Just sprinkle it. Sprinkle it throughout. And then have a little bit... Um, no, I want you... Like that. That's okay. That's alright. Yeah, that's okay. Um, and so, yeah, I think... So, I think the main export... Now you guys can give me feedback on this in the comments and stuff. Uh, love, always love hearing your opinions and ideas. Um, but I think the main export uh, would be fish. And what else did I say? Fish and fishing supplies. Or, and, and wheat slash bread. I think that could be good. Maybe they're really, because I got the wheat field, maybe they've got like super great wheat. Um, super great wheat for different breads, different everything. Um, it, yeah, I think that would be cool. I think that could really make for a nice, and one of these, we could have these be more, um, I forgot the beds were bouncy, fishing supplies and very i don't know exactly you guys maybe the customs house and fishing supplies could be here because it just kind of makes sense to be right on the dock um and then that could be something else i don't know uh one thing i did want to show you this uh real quick i did 
make sure we'll do that yeah sure I did uh, extend this out a bit and make this little well, one hole apparently but I did make just a really simple little walkway up uh, this is not finished um, and I, a couple, I do have a couple questions for you guys in this episode. One being, should we leave this up here like it is now and try and incorporate this little pond in? Or should we bring this hill all the way across? I'm leaning towards bringing the hill all the way across. But would love to hear your thoughts on that. Uh, would love to be able to kind of brainstorm with you because I really don't have any ideas for this up here. We're not going to be tackling this for a little bit, this upper area. Ouch. Um, we're going to be tackling that, I think, first, once we get the dock situated. Because it's going to be the uh, storage area, the, like a little warehouse or something. Or one of these could be the warehouse. Maybe that makes more sense, is for one of these to be the warehouse. Like maybe this guy's the warehouse, the customs house, or the customs play, the customs house and then fishing supplies maybe that's what we'll do and then that can be like that original idea of a like boat checking area maybe i don't know let's see if we can throw some of these down um sorry if this seems all over the place again yeah sure yeah i think that looks fine just a couple little things i don't really know it just adds a little bit of detail, adds a little bit of fun stuff going on. It doesn't do much. It's like not bad. It's not great. Yeah, like oh, it's gonna. It throws me so much. That, like I know I love the crate block, but it just throws me so much. Ooh, we should get some nets going. I don't have any cobwebs. That is something we should definitely do. Um, what else we got in here? Some of these. I don't know if these are going to look any good. <laughs> sure. Why not? I'm not going to go throwing them around everywhere, but... That don't make sense. Why would that be up there? Eh. I think that's good. I don't think we need anything crazy spectacular happening. I did want to try these up here. Mm. It's alright. I think I might do a different color, but it's not bad. I do think that this wall needs a, just a hint more uh, going on, but I can work, on, work that off camera. Um, and I'll definitely do some work off camera to get this dock a little more situated. Um, but yeah, I really just need wanted to get a video out to you and get this dock decorated a little bit as well. Um, all right, sorry about that. I just wanted to check my recording software because for some reason it didn't seem like it was working, but it was. Everything's good, uh, but sadly that I checked the time on it and checked how much how long we were getting and we are actually out of time so i hope i know we didn't do a ton in this episode but i think the dock now looks really really good um i, I think it's got some great decor going on i think we're gonna get some jet outs a little few jet outs or i need to look a little bit more into bay area docks to get some inspiration um for how ships will pull in um but yeah i think this dock looks really good uh, I just wanted to, um, and I just wanted to, um, I'd love to get your feedback on the import export sort of ideas, main export, main exports from here being like, um, fish, fishing supplies, that sort of stuff. And maybe even wheat and bread or something, something along those lines, I think would be really tie in with the place and really give this place a little bit more story and maybe so for metals and stuff we don't have a blacksmith because we import that um, that's kind of my thought process currently um, so i would love to hear your thoughts on that 
and love to hear some ideas for stalls and stuff. And yeah, I think that'd be really good. And we could really start building up the lore and such of this area. Um, but yeah, guys, I think that's going to do it for this episode. Sorry, it's short, but just trying to get onto this new schedule and Easter break, kind of threw everything into a little tizzy. Um, but hopefully we'll get things worked out. I'll definitely work ahead for the next episode. Um, and yeah, so I will see you guys in the next episode.